up guys, welcome back to the channel. I'm uh... <laughs> <laughs> you're what? You're what? Why are you so nervous? So guys, welcome back to the channel. Right now I'm currently heading out to Irvine. As you guys can see, I'm on the freeway. You can point at the freeway. And then now, you can point back at me. <laughs> So I got a new cameraman, camera girl. I'm heading on Irvine right now. We're stopped by David Buster's just because they have half on games and um, just go and have some fun. And before that, we're gonna go get something to eat. And after that, we're gonna have some dinner somewhere. I'm not too sure, but if you guys didn't know, I started a Law Eats Law Instagram. So it's more like a foodie Instagram. And I kind of want to branch off into doing car videos, food videos, or you know, food reviews. Also about school, you know, software engineering. So multiple like subjects or categories for my YouTube channel because I still want to upload videos and I feel like I haven't really been uploading consistently compared to like back then to all you OG followers that follow me do you know that I used to upload like every other day or every Oof. sorry we have my T6 right now um, the bumps or the camera gets to be hitting the shock tower but uh yeah and then I still don't know where we're going first to get food at. Uh, we haven't ate yet, so hopefully it's a good spot. And I'll probably let um, her figure out what we're gonna eat because she's actually a lot better at. Side the airbag off. You don't weigh anything. Look. <laughs> oh really? Yeah. <laughs> so yeah, we're gonna get some food and I'll get back to you guys in a bit on where we're gonna eat at. But uh, yeah, like 20 minutes or right? Like 30 minutes. <laughs> As I can see from the back, I've actually been doing parts runs for my brother. So uh, I think I will unveil these when I drop it off to him. There's two things down there. They're pretty big. I think most of you guys already know. Um, and if you guys follow me on my Instagram, he did post about it. They are definitely bucket seats, but what type of bucket seats? Right? So the girl found a spot to go see. It's called Trade Marketplace, right in Irvine, like next to the John Wayne Airport. So. And down the street we're about to pull up and then supposedly it's a new spot and we're gonna see what they have go explore and see what food they have i think we're trying to get something healthy but at the same time it's kind of a new spot so i have mixed feelings on it we have arrived to the trade marketplace ultra sushi oh there's a subway what's that thai body works so what's here Oh. So I would be inside of oh, this yeah. little area. Wow, this looks really damn nice. Like, oh. Oops. Script, script, script. It's like, it's like Koko Ichibanya. This place is actually pretty cool. Two birds? Is this like jailbirds or whatever it's called? Yeah, it's like hot chicken, I think. Oh, this is a healthy spot, huh? Crips? So we stopped by this place called Crips. Chris? I can't say it right. And it looks like they have a bunch of matcha stuff. Um, this is matcha too. This is coconut. This is the regular signature matcha. And then this is like, what is this, a nasi bowl? Yeah, it's like the super greens bowl. Okay, super green, but it's like, so it's like a, it's like a matcha, or like matcha base, or I don't even know, super green, so. Look at that granola on the bottom. Yeah. Alright, so. It looks like there's blueberries. I need a coconut flake. Mmm. So it tastes like um, it tastes like green, like a green juice.
It doesn't be like Acido, but it's like more like a green juice, so... Hmm. Let me try the... Sensor Pancha. As a figure, it just tastes like regular matcha. Mm -hmm. This one's a like coconut matcha. Mm. That one has almond milk in it, so. Yeah. I don't really taste the coconut. But it tastes like a very like unsweetened matcha. It's good though, but this is uh, this is different though. This is pretty good. Though. I think it. What do you think? I mean, I like the toppings. Like the but toppings. Yeah, it's definitely. It tastes like a green smoothie with toppings. That's it. Like a green smoothie acai bowl. Yeah, but I mean they weren't that expensive. Yeah, it's really cheap. I think for all three it was like what twenty bucks. Yeah, and. Well, oh, my drink, my food's ready. Sliders? I knew it. I knew it. They're pretty good though. Yeah. They're like sliders. It was part of this place called Champion Curry. And I was telling her that it might be slider size <laughs> for the price. But only $14.50 for the Yeah. Sandwich. What's this? Curry? Curry dip sauce? Looks like ketchup. Mm. So you come to the curry and ketchup? Curry. Tastes like curry. So first is the chicken katsu sandwich. Yeah, with coleslaw. I guess you dip it. That's how it is. I see that. It's so good. It's really juicy. It's definitely a. Um, it's definitely deep fried. I think they deep fried. It. Yeah, Katsu's oh, yeah, deep, deep fried. fried. <laughs> yeah, that's crispy. All right. How would you rate that? To be honest, it tastes like a regular, um, it tastes like a regular chicken sandwich. It's just the curry sauce is what makes it different. But it tastes exactly the same as a regular chicken sandwich you can get at a McDonald's. Mm -hmm. um, but besides, it's really juicy though. The thing only has coleslaw, katsu, and cheese in the bun, that's it. And this one right here is... Um, the Wagyu beef? This one's Wagyu? Mm hmm. Wagyu beef burger. Oh my god. To be honest, I hate tomatoes. But it's diced. The salsa. Ooh. I miss the tomato, but I hate tomatoes. But, um. I think the Wagyu one tastes better. The Wagyu tastes better than the chicken katsu? Yeah, definitely hands down. I would say it just tastes like regular, like a regular chicken sandwich you get anywhere. I see. Um, but besides that, uh, it's good. The Wagyu one's really juicy. I never would have thought I would be dipping fries in curry. <laughs> That's why when I bit into it, it kind of tasted funny. Yeah, the meat's raw. Glad I didn't finish it. That's raw, right? I think so. That looks raw. No, I mean, that is. Why? Unless? I don't know. If maybe their meat is good to cook like that, but that's definitely raw meat. Yeah. Um, yeah, I didn't finish this. This to me was not the greatest. This one's very important that it's not raw. <laughs> yeah, that's chicken. But it looks. It didn't. Look... Yeah, this one looks okay. I think deep fried, you can't really mess it up. Too yeah. Much. Yeah, this is fine. But that's raw. Oh, uh, okay. Well, um, you said you could taste coconut in this one? Yeah, I could. 
You can't? Yeah. Oh, I can't. <laughs> Our taste buds are different. Taste buds are Yeah. yeah. Um, but yeah, this place is called Champion Curry. It's Irvine, next to John Wayne Airport. Um, yeah, <clears throat> that meat's raw. I'm glad I didn't finish it though. I only took one bite. That bite in the video, that's all it took. I didn't eat any more because, I don't know. It was good, but it was eh. Something about it. And this is like, ugh. Compared to Coco's, Coco's fire. Coco's is fire. Yeah, she finished her thingy. You liked it? It was bomb? It was okay. It was okay? Yeah. Scale 1 to 10. 7. 7? Yeah, I that think That's actually pretty high, there. coming from you. <laughs> this right here, definitely for me, is a... I'll say 4. Really? <laughs> yeah, 4. The only thing I liked was the fries. Yeah. The Thai was good too, but... The curry is good too. I, I think the curry is good, but the katsu was kind of salty. Yeah. And this the uh, this place is pretty bomb though for sure. This concludes now. Wait, what is this place called? Anyways, nice location, but off to go have some fun. And here's my uh, me sex. Sheesh. Mike, don't like those. <laughs> I don't know. So that concludes us at Trade. Might be back here because they actually have a place called Duck Donuts right here. They have some pretty appetizing looking donuts and I kind of want some, but not right now. We shouldn't be eating donuts though. So. They got a lot of places here and there's some places that haven't opened it inside the plaza, but hopefully it opens soon. We're always around this area, so we can always stop by and check it out whenever we're in the area. Probably like in like a couple weeks or a month, maybe, huh? Yeah. Yeah. Or next week. Yeah, but <laughs> um, out of everything here, this place pretty bomb. And if you guys love matcha, matcha, their drinks, this, huh? yeah, their this, drinks. yeah, it's really good. Right? Probably their coffee too. Ooh, I should got their coffee. Yeah. I tried to get an Oreo latte. Was it Oreo latte? Oreo matcha latte, but they didn't have Oreo in stock. Must try place if you guys love matcha. They also have really healthy acai bowls and just food in general. Um, but I decided just getting some curry at Champion Curry, and that, um, to be honest, is not it. But let's go have some fun. Oh, shut up. <laughs>